Hello everyone and welcome back to Roots of Paja. My name is Melanie B. It is now Saturday the 13th of spring in year number one. Okay, we'll head outside. So the last time we went back into the caves to get some more flint. And we also met some new neighbors. There's two additional clans. We only met one though. I think it was the Yaku ones. And the other one is the Mograni, but we didn't get to meet them. Apparently they are not very good. They're not good clan members. Because they seem a little bit violent maybe. But we'll have to wait and see. Now let's find Acre. Here's your new chew. I made it, so it's going to last for years. Nice. So we got a new tool now. It's a funny thought. Sometimes you have to break your rock to make it stronger. Okay, let's see if we can do another one. So, this one will need, for the flint hammer, we need more wood. And for the shears, we also need more wood. And hardwood we haven't found yet. And the flint axe is what we have now. Okay, so let's get some more wood. So, tools. There is our new flint axe. Let's see if we can chop this tree down now. Yes, we can. So is this going to give us hardwood? It does! <laughs> this is great. Okay, so let's see if it takes less hits to break down these other wood. It certainly does. Just one instead of two now. So we'll use up less stamina overall. And what about the rocks? Okay, no impact on the rocks. Well, let's get out up to our crops. Need to get those watered too. Okay, need more wood. Let's check on this little guy here. So, still says well fed and it has three hearts. So somehow it's getting fed. <laughs> so we don't have to worry about him. That's good. The hammer only destroys the wood, so we can't do anything about the fiber or the stone with it. So I'll we'll have to switch back to the hand axe, I guess. But let's... Oh! Oh no! I accidentally chopped down my, ch my tomato bush. Okay. Let's get some water. So now that we have this new hammer, I'm wondering if we can get to the next area of the cave. Let's get some more water here. I wonder how many days we have in spring. I would assume it's 28, but I'm not entirely sure. 
I guess we'll have to wait and see. Okay, that's all the crops. And we got some tomatoes now. So let's put that away. We'll hang on to the hardwood. Uh, let's not hang on to the hardwood. Let's leave it in here. We'll get this other tool. I think that's for the wood bucket. We'll get that made, made another day instead. So I assume we could only do one tool at a time. Grab that last piece of wood and go see Acre again. Okay, we're lost. Where is Acre? Acre, where are you? My goodness, Acre is hiding. <laughs> oh, we can collect these two. I guess we'll take that. But still can't find Acre. Let's look at the map. Maybe she's just inside. Now I need to figure out which house. Acre, are you here? Well, I really want to go up to the cave, but I want to get my tool started. Okay, view on map. Okay, I see where she is. <laughs> so let's do... Hardwood bucket needs 20 hardwood. Okay, so should I do the blade shears or this? I think I want to do the flint hammer first. Let's get it crafted. Hmm, interesting tool. A few precise hits with my hammer. Here and there, and then a bit of chiseling. Yes. Are you still here? Okay, so she can only do one per day. Which is fair. Okay, now we need to get over to the cave. So go across the water here. So now are we able to chop down this tree? I'm already out of stamina. No, <laughs> and I don't have anything to refill. I should have kept my tomatoes. Okay, maybe we won't go to the caves today. Because it's already midday. Maybe we'll have some tomatoes and do a little fishing instead. And I should check on my quest. Mary finished working on her idea 
Oh, we should check in with Mary too. And she's heading this way right now. Kuro the sun has revealed how to harness the power of time. We should build a monument to honor him by tracking its shadow. So now we can make a sundial. Okay. So let's see our next spot. We can put it here. That's not gonna fit. Um, right here seems good. That's great. Carl will start working on it as soon as he can. Okay, so we finished the idea for the sundial. So let's grab some tomatoes. Tomatoes is also eight stamina. And wild potatoes, eight. Uh, the carrot is the one that gives 10. So let's eat that. Maybe we should donate a little bit of everything to the to the contribution box today. So let's grab four t tomatoes and we should grab four of these beans and We'll just grab one potato. But let's have a little carrot for our snack. Oops. And we'll eat it. Okay, fishing time. Yep, that one got away. Maybe we should try going over by where the Yaku ones entered. That place that was cleared out. And see if there's any other fish we can find there. Or maybe we can even meet some of the Yaku ones. Oh no, lost it again. Okay, got it, <laughs> finally. That took a while. Let's get it onto the smoker. So, where was it that was cleared out? I think it's down this way. Okay, was it across here? Yeah. Oh, look at this. It's like the desert. Let's see if we can chop down this tree. Yeah. But am I a lot of stamina? <laughs> I'll eat a potato. Or this is tomato. We'll eat a tomato. Okay, got some more energy now. So just regular wood and a pink shell. Okay, oops. There's another shell here, but our backpack is full of cores. There's different types of palm trees. This is Brub. Nice to meet you. I'm Brub of the Yaku ones. 
and croc hey there I'm croc more stuff I can pick up ooh a new seed sea kale okay so we can probably fish here but I have no space to hold anything Oh, there's so many regions to explore. Okay, we should probably be heading back now. Let's look at this map though. And there's a cave over here too. And like little islands out there. Okay, we should get back though. And I need to make some contributions before going to bed. This pink shell, all of our tomatoes, all the wild beans, and a potato. Okay, let's head to bed. So for spring 13, the clan contributions was 1308, clan prosperity 16,000 now, almost 17, and our contribution for today is 111. Pretty good, I guess. Okay, well I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.